Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder at CommitmentConnection.com. And today we're going to talk about how to get a guy to notice you. So um, if you see a guy that you like and you want to make sure that he notices you, then this is what you need to do. Um, so when I walk into a room as a guy, uh, there's some women that I notice and there's some women that I don't. And, and I'm just going to tell you a little bit about what I notice, and I'm going to give you kind of four things that you can do to get a guy to notice you better. And so here are the four things. The first one is wear something that stands out. When I say stand out, I, I don't mean you need to look like a peacock or anything. Um, but what I do mean is that you you need to wear something that uh, that that looks good, right? That maybe form fits your body or maybe is different than, um, you, you know, may, maybe is a little bit a notch, just one notch above what people who are wherever you are, are going to wear. Um, that, that can be really, really powerful uh, in just about any situation. Um, the second thing that you need to do is get near the guy. Right, so the closer that you can get, I mean, you don't want to, you know, be breathing down his neck or anything, but, uh, you know, get get close to the guy, get near where he is. That way, he can notice you, and it's not like this thing where he's, you know, you're trying to get him to notice you from like across the room or anything like that. And then the the third thing that you want to do is make eye contact with him. Right, there, there's uh, there's actually this, um, there's this uh study that that was done a while back about intimacy and what they found was that there's a series of different steps that people go through uh, who end up becoming intimate with each other and the very first step is um, making eye contact and so what you want to do is make eye contact with this guy because that's that's the first step um, uh, there's a lot of bad dating advice out there that's like, you know, talking about faking disinterest and pretend like you don't like a guy and all that nonsense that's that's out there. Um, don't follow that, okay? What you do want to do is make eye contact with him, which can show him some interest or some possible interest. And uh, But it, it can be really, really powerful. You know, most guys... Uh, don't approach women unless they get some kind of signal or invitation. And so when you look at him in the eye, um, you're kind of, you're like getting his, and you don't want to do it in a creepy way and you don't want to do it for, you know, too long. You can just do it for, you know, one or two seconds, just look him in the eye and then, you know, you can turn away. Um, but, you know, make eye contact and, and, and then smile, just smile, just give him a little smile and uh, that can be really powerful. And then the last thing that you want to do is project feminine energy. And I, and I know that this um, th this is one of those things where a lot of women are like, oh, I don't want to, you know, do something different or, you know, try to act like I'm fe more feminine than I am or whatever. Um, but let me tell you something. Uh, first, all women have feminine energy. All of them do. Every single woman that I've ever met, even the ones that are like... <laughs> burly masculine women they've got a feminine side to them and the second thing is that men are irresistibly drawn towards feminine the feminine parts of a woman and when a guy walks into a room and a woman's feminine she stands out from everybody else that's that's in there because most women these days aren't very feminine and they don't know how to get in touch with their feminine side. And so if you do know how to do that and you do that and you project it when you're in a room with a guy, um, that can be very powerful uh, towards getting his attention. So uh, that's it for today. If you want more information on how to attract a quality man into a committed, lasting relationship, Make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take my quiz there. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.